In the U.S. Army, esprit de corps is an essential element of unit cohesion. During Fort Polk's Warrior Week, 3rd Brigade Combat Team, 10th Mountain Division, Patriots, came together with all the installation's other units, interacting in ways that measure beyond these units' typical working relationships. Many say the Warrior Week competitions and events present a unique way to build camaraderie with other soldiers. I mean, you get, get to know people uh, in a different way outside of work, you know, just for a fun-loving sport. Because they have fun and everybody jokes around and good morale. Warrior Week featured several intense sporting competitions, such as an endurathon held at Alligator Lake, which included a mud run, a five-mile bike race, a three-mile circuit around the lake in canoes, five miles of running, a rucksack raft float, and ended with a sprint to the finish line. Other events included a CrossFit competition and basketball, softball, and flag football tournaments. Despite unpredictable weather during the week, event coordinators worked together to ensure that all planned events went on without a hitch. We were supposed to play yesterday, but the field wasn't ready because of the weather, so we had to uh, shift and uh, make things happen based on the weather. During each event, it was clear that competitors and onlookers alike enjoyed the opportunity for spirited competition with their fellow brothers and sisters in arms that Fort Polk's Warrior Week creates. For the last two years that I've been a part of, I think it's great. It's great for the, for the unit, for the post. Everybody gets to get out, interact with each other, mingle with each other, and, and just have fun. When the competitions were over and the numbers were in, for the second year in a row, the 3rd Brigade Combat Team, 10th Mountain Division Patriots, emerged as the overall winners, taking home several first place trophies, including the JRTC and Fort Polk Commander's Cup. Reporting from Fort Polk, I'm Specialist Henri Barrille.